Hey superstars, it's your girl Malika, aka Miss Magic, back with another video. Today we are making these delicious sweet chili honey air fryer wings. But first, if you are new here, welcome to my channel. Thank you for coming. Go ahead, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for me, give me a big thumbs up, and hit that notification bell so you can be alerted when I do post another video. Alright guys, let's get straight into this recipe. First of all, we're going to go ahead and we're going to... Get our chicken wings out we're going to wash them thoroughly i like to uh, squeeze lemon on mine and then give them a good scrubbing with lemon and water so once we scrub our wings with lemon and water we we'll did i think i soaked them in the lemon water for about 10 minutes and now i'm going to get ready to chop them up i'm going to go ahead and section them off and cut off the tips that just makes it easier because a lot of people just like flats and some people like drums. Most people like flats. Which one do you like? Let me know in the description box. But once we get them all separated, now we're gonna go ahead and get our seasonings ready. We're gonna start off with our adobe season salt. I use about a tablespoon of that. Then I'm gonna go in with my Slap Your Mama, which I use about a tablespoon of the Slap Your Mama. Once I'm done with that, I use about a tablespoon of this Magic Salt Free Creole Seasoning. Love that. And now I'm going to go ahead and give that a good stir. Once I get it all stirred up, now we're going to go ahead and spray our chicken wings with butter spray. You can use whatever kind of spray you want. You can use olive oil or you can use real olive oil and put that in like a spray bottle which I said I'm gonna do eventually but now we're gonna go ahead and season our chicken liberally very liberally gotta have your season on your chicken and then once I've done that I'm gonna go ahead and turn my chicken wings over and season the other side we'll spray it again and then we'll go ahead and we will season all of that chicken now we're going to go ahead and let cover our chicken and let it sit for about 10 to 15 minutes just to let those seasonings get in there good. Go ahead and turn on your air fryer. Once, once Before we get started on turning our air fryer, I want to show you guys what I like to use and that's a liner, a parchment liner. They come like this or you could just use regular parchment. This is an air fryer lifesaver. If you are not using those, what are you doing? So go ahead and go put your parchment paper in and now we're going to go ahead and line it and put our wings in. Make sure that no wings are really touching. Make sure they're all separated just like this. I mean, well, they can touch, but just not on top of each other, I should say. I'm going to go ahead and put my air fryer on 395 and let that cook for about 27 minutes. 27 28 roundabout that's what i really feel like the chicken wings are done on well i put it on 28 no i put it on 27 okay let's get it started while we're doing that now we're going to make our sauce our own homemade barbecue sweet chili sauce i start off with about one fourth cup of ketchup next i'm going to use about um let's see maybe i don't know what i use about one third cup of brown sugar Next, I'll use about two tablespoons of Worcestershire sauce. This gives it a great color and a hearty flavor. So um, now I'm going to go ahead and make sure that brown sugar is stirred up in that ketchup and that Worcestershire sauce. So you want to break down your sugar. Yeah, I wanted mine a little bit more brown, so I went on and put a little bit more Worcestershire sauce in it. That's the color I'm looking for. Now I'm going to go ahead and add our star of the show, which is the sweet chili. I add about one third cup of sweet chili and I'm going to use red wine vinegar and also I'm going to use my honey That's the next second star of the show some brown black pepper and some garlic minced garlic and I will squeeze about a quarter of a lemon in there right now I'm just going to take my garlic and put it in you can use as much garlic as you want or you don't have to use any garlic at all no big deal. Now I'm gonna use about one teaspoon of the red wine vinegar. Next, I'm gonna use one third cup of honey. 
and then we're going to go ahead and use about one third cup of the sweet chili. After that, go ahead and sprinkle in some ground uh, black pepper. You see about one teaspoon, that's all you need. And I'm gonna go ahead and squeeze in the whole lemon. If you had a little quarter of lime, you could use that too. Barbecue sauce is like, it's like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're gonna get. Hopefully you'll luck up on something, but this sweet chili barbecue sauce recipe right here is hitting, it is the stuff. So I went on and made that up. And now once our chicken is halfway done, we're going to go ahead and turn our chicken over. And guys, what I'm so sorry that I didn't show you, at the end of the 27 minutes, I went ahead and put the barbecue sauce on it. I glazed it. As you see, look, the magic of television. Already done. But then once you put our sauce on the first time, you're going to let that go for five minutes. Turn it over like I'm doing now. I, like I said, I already glazed the chicken. Sorry, I didn't get a chance to show you guys, but I'm turning it over and then I'm going to reglaze it on the other side. And then we're going to let that go back in the air fryer for about three more minutes. So I'll show you guys this is exactly what I did to the first side after the chicken went for 27 minutes. I glazed it and I said five minutes now for three more minutes. We're going to go ahead and let that go three more minutes and then after the three minutes it's going to turn out into our deliciously wonderful sweet chili honey air fryer wings they are simply to die for this is what I they look like and now we're gonna go in for our taste this is our finished product I have extra sweet chili sauce on the side for dipping and some lemon wedges I'm gonna go in with this roasted garlic aioli that is delicious by Hellman's. Man, put a little bit of that on top. And then at the end of the day, of course, we have to garnish it with our uh, parsley flakes for the ending. And this is what you get. All right, there you go with the green parsley. Now we're gonna go ahead and taste our wings. I just want to show you what it's looking like and there it is nice tender juicy chicken that sauce tell me how you like this sauce or tell me what you would do different to the sauce as you see it pulls away from the bone nice and done all right guys i want to thank you for watching don't forget to hit that subscribe button for me give me a big thumbs up and hit that notification bell so you can be alerted when i do post another video I hope to see you guys in past, present, and future videos. Thanks for watching. Love you guys. Bye.